All right, today I want to show you how to get your um, website indexed on Google in a very fast time. Okay, um, I just picked up this um, website work a few days ago and it has been having an um, indexing issue. You'll be getting things like your website has been crawled but not indexed. Okay, it means that Google has actually discovered the website but does not be indexed on the Google search page. So, what do you do when you have such issue? Okay, just like some of the pages on this website are not yet indexed because I'm still working on them. So what you want to do is number one thing is you want to come to the um, inspection URL. You want to inspect the website. Okay, for example, I'm taking this as a case study. So you want to inspect the website to see um, if the website is actually indexed or not. You can see URL is not on Google. So if the URL is not on Google, the one thing you want to do is you want to request for indexing. Um, okay, you want to text live URL first to see if the URL is accessible, if it's something that Google can actually discover. So, and if it's giving you things like crawled, it means that it can be discovered. Just like you can see in this area, it says crawled, currently not indexed. So it means that Google can actually discover this page, but there are some factors that are actually blocking the page from being indexed. It's either issue with your sitemap or your robot.m robot.txt um, <clears throat> file either of the two is blocking google from um, indexing that page or probably there are issues on the website that you actually need to fix all right whichever way is the issue so all you just have to do is um you have to test your life if it is live then request for indexing if um that is done after you have requested for indexing don't um but uh, then the next thing you have to go is you have to go to your um bing search um search to so sorry naughty so when you go to your bing search to you go to um url submission when you go to url submission what you want to do is you want to insert that url in the url submission um page so once you insert your url in the url submission um form then <clears throat> it will bring out all the issues relating to the link then you have to fix them okay sometimes it can be a canonical link sometimes it can be um <clears throat> too much um let's say for example either one so for example it is ideal that you only have one either one in a post so if you're having multiple either one and all of that you want to fix that you get so when you click on the submit url okay i don't know yep so I'm going to just input that URL. So once you input that URL, you click on submit. It will be among the submitted um, list of URL. So I'm not going to do this. So come to, oh, sorry, I, I forget, my bad. Before the submit URL, you want to come to inspect URL first. You want to inspect the URL to know what is wrong. Why is it not being indexed? Why is the URL not on, um, on Google or Bing um, search page? So once you inspect URL, for example, you can see URL cannot appear on Bing. You, you have to see the reason why. Okay. The inspected URL is known to Bing, but has some issues. That means Bing has actually crawled the URL, but has not been indexed. Okay. Preventing us from, um, you, you get serving the user. So now if you look at, um, Okay, or oh, if you look at all of that, so now that can be as the issue from your what's it called from your um sitemap or what's it called? Uh, sorry, I don't know, I'm forgetting this or your robot.txt. So you need to fix them, then you need to go to the website. And some of the time, you have to check your website if you have dead links, maybe there are external links that you added to your page or to your blog post. You have to check if they are still active. I do have that most of the time. I just have to check back my blog post and I see that. So I have a lot of dead links. So there are tools on online. You can use Google search to find out dead links on your website. So all these things are factors that, um, that stop your website from being ranked or from being indexed on Google. So once you fix that, the next thing you want to do is you want to come back to Google URL submission and submit. Then you can see that at the end of the day to be, um, what's it called? it will be um, you can now request for indexing so when you request for indexing it's processed to see if the live url is access accessible then if that is then it's put it in the queue we yeah, um we will later go into it and see if the url can be indexed and after that once google finally index your page you can go back to bing and submit it then it's sh it's sure going to work out
so you can see and if you come back here i have been able to index 95 pages in in two days so all i just have to do is you can see here 52 have not been indexed actually not all the 52 can be indexed there are some pages that i ex exclude that i don't need to um index for example like category pages and all of that i don't need them to be indexed i just need the main content to be indexed so and when you look at it you see two reasons you have to look at the reasons why these pages are not being indexed so when you come down in you can see this is data for the index one and if i come in i can see the reasons why um these pages are not being indexed the first reason here is that the validation failed sorry i don't know why they i think it's the network this time i think the network so once you find out the reason you can see crawled but not indexed so you want to look at the affected pages okay these are the affected pages then you want to look at what are the reasons why this page is not being indexed what is the reason why it's not being indexed so you can see you can test your robot the text blocking to see if there is any line of code there blocking this from being indexed and if you look at this link here i don't need this to be indexed because i'm having uh, the, um, at the end of this slash feed there's no page like this it doesn't exist on my website so you get so i don't need that to be indexed actually so that's why i'm saying that not all of these pages will be indexed so you want to inspect the url if i inspect the url you see that it's not valid so i think with this you can actually boost your search engine opti um, optimization you can actually help your website to rank more and get it indexed on google in short time or right, thank you for watching this episode see you later